Hi everyone and welcome back to some more Alpha Centauri. So, I'm wondering how much we could push this border by settling a city right here. We should be able to push it a little bit. Let's give it a shot. As for the farmers, let's have a look. What do we need the most? What do we actually have over here? Nothing right now. What kind of terrain is it? Flat and rainy. Okay. So farm, solar panel and a road. Okay, sounds good. And one more colony pod. Send that one west. That was the plan. And that is still the plan. Alright, these guys need to heal up. And let's actually start a colony right here. We should be able to push the border a little bit. And we did, nice. So, what do we need first? Maybe a garrison, that's fine. And then... Recycling tanks? And then we'll see. Probably farmers. But alright, that will do for now. Next. Wait, what is actually attacking us here? Not quite sure what's going on there. Anyway, another farm. So farm, solar panel and road. Sounds good, and I need to get out of here. I'm trying. Where exactly do we want to settle? Probably on the coast. That's what I'm thinking. Oh, we moved into his territory, didn't we? Production. Yeah, we did actually. The border is right here. I think we'll settle on this exact tile. This one right here. That way we should be able to push the border a little bit. That's the general idea. Alright. More farmers? I don't think we need yet another one. Probably not. Let's see, labs bonus. We do have some drones in here. Which basically means unrest. So, I guess that's what we'll work on. There's a garrison, recycling tanks are next. And let's see. Farm, mine and road. Okay, sure. Carry on. Yo, need to wait. He's 80% damaged, that's not so great. And this will be the colony, right here, on this tile. Let's just wait for the next turn. So, we keep getting attacked by the pirates, guys. I don't think I can do much about that. Human behavior is economic behavior. The particulars may vary, but competition for limited resources remains a constant. Need as well as greed have followed us to the stars and the rewards of wealth still await those wise enough to recognize this deep thrumming of our common pulse. CEO Nwabuda K. Morgan, the Centauri Monopoly. A lot of these quotes are really good, so I'll try to stop for all of them. It's just a habit from like 2000 hours of C5. Anyway, we got the Merchant Exchange, that's plus one energy in every square at this base. That is not bad at all. Alright. So, what next? Network node, let's get recreation commons. Production complete. And we need to do something to kill this guy, but I don't think we can actually attack him. We need some military attacks. <laughs> That's what we need. Okay, farm, solar panel and road. And we got more farmers. I think that's quite enough farmers at this point. Oh, base cannot be built in rocky areas. Alright, that's fine. Okay, we don't need any more farmers. This is enough. Change. Recreation commons. Oh yeah, we could plant some forests. And forests prevent the spread of Xenofungus. 
that is not a bad idea. Where's the forest? Plant forest. Let's do that. Why not? And we'll start a colony. There. Guild house. We already have a garrison, so... I guess we'll get recreation commons? Or no, first we'll get recycling tanks. Then we can get recreation commons. Alright. Sounds good. Yeah, these guys are really getting on my nerves by now. Very annoying. Plant another forest. What do you want? Let's have a look. Pact of Brotherhood. Maybe? I don't know about that. I think I'll pass for now. He wants industrial base. Okay. I think that's fine. If we go for a trade. No, he doesn't want to go for a trade. You know what? Fine, you can have it. Let's maintain a good relationship with him. Treat your friendship. Yep, that's fine. We're done here. Right, we need some naval units, but I don't think we can actually build any just yet. Let's see, what's next? Blubs bonus. Alright, that's fine. More farmers. Yeah, this is quite enough farmers. What can we get here? Yeah, not much, really. Alright. We keep getting attacked. Can we just peace out or something like that? That's this guy. He wants us to renounce our pact with the peacekeepers, who are our neighbors. I think I'll pass on that. He wants industrial base. Everyone wants that. I suppose we can accept that. Alright, we got the truth. Really? He wants treaty of friendship now. Okay. That seems a little bit sudden. But fine, I'm not quite ready to go to war with anyone just yet. I'm just saying. Right, back to improvements. I think we can get a mine here. Farm, mine, road. Alright, sure. Definitely need roads. And a road over here. Scientific and we got applied physics. Coherence so that unlocks the laser. Experience and the simplicity with which they do so. Laser squad, okay. Sounds good. Recon rover with a laser. Okay, what can we get next? Let's see. How about Doctrine Flexibility? That sounds like a good idea. Allows base to survive submersion. Also counts as recycling tanks for this base, okay? We can also unlock an actual naval unit. Which is what we need against the pirates. The pirates are actually a faction that starts with a home base at sea. I think that's the only one that starts not on land. If I do another game after this, I might actually play as the pirates. But we'll see. Let's not get ahead of ourselves just yet. Production complete. So, that's a lot of farmers. I guess we can speed up road construction. <laughs> just a little bit. Complete. We got recreation commons. So... 
What can we get next? Labs bonus? Alright, sounds good. Let's see. What kind of terrain is this? Rocky and rainy. A mine in that case. And finish connecting the colony. We already got a road here, right? Yes, we do. Keep moving. Farm, solar panel and road. And this tile is already improved. Okay. One more. And one more road. What do you want? Wait, what? He wants us to declare war on the pirates again. No, I don't think so. Yeah, whatever you say. He wants 50 energy credits. <laughs> So, saw me. So, he declared war on us? Well, whatever. He's not really our neighbor. I don't think we have to care. We don't even know where exactly he is. Yeah, I don't think I really care about that. Once we get access to some naval units, we can build a few to scout the sea. That's the general idea. Okay, carry on. Let's have a look. I don't think we need roads on regular tiles. I don't think so. Let's plant a forest, why not? And get some more mines. Improvement already exists. One more road. Alright, what's next in here? Can we start any more colonies? Probably. And this one... Oh yeah, we should build some laser squads, I guess. Alright. Another road. Yeah, one more. Then the base will be connected. Network node. Which is our highest production? base right now. Let's have a look. Seven, six... Seven minerals is the highest production we got. Okay. So this base isn't actually doing anything right now. Let's see. Plus 50% terraform rate. 20 turns. Let's give it a Project shot, why not? Initiated. And guild house. We can grab a laser squad. Maybe command center. Plus two morale for land units. Before we start recruiting any. Terraform. One more road. And we can grab some mines. Terraform complete. Alright, looks good. What do you want? Probably to declare war on someone. I've recently obtained a complete map of every major hive installation. 50 energy credits. 50 energy credits is not much, we can accept that. 
we're done here. So he's over here. A little bit far away, I don't think we'll be attacking him. At least not anytime soon, I guess. We got better things to do at the moment. So a few more forests. He held his arm to and we got Doctrine Flexibility. That gives us actual naval units. And also a transport. Alright. Laser skim ship and sea formers. And sea colony pod. Right, we can get a sea colony pod. What's next? Plasma steel armor. Sounds promising. Abilities. Heavy artillery. Okay. Heavy artillery units bombard their targets from a distance rather than attacking them directly. Up to two squares away. Alright. What else? Particle impactor. So a better weapon. Perimeter defense. Command nexus. Counts as command center at every one of your bases. Okay. That's one of the secret projects. Let's actually go for particle impactor. Production. Sounds complete. good. Okay, what's next? We have enough formers by now. So labs bonus. Superior training and superior weapon. There's the command center. And we can get some naval units now. Let's get a laser scheme ship first. And I might consider a sea colony pod after that. That will take 10 turns. Okay. So, what's next? Maybe a mine or two. That definitely wouldn't hurt. Enemy project initiated. Yep, others are getting the secret projects done as well. Also, here's faction dominance, so actual score, I suppose. Terraform complete. We are not even listed here. It's mostly the pirates leading. So, you know, the guys we were at war with not too long ago. We'll probably have to do something about that at some point. What do you want? He has a map, but he wants our tech. Planetary networks. No thanks. I'm not interested. Nice try, but that information is confidential. If you give me a tech, industrial economics, I would accept that. Yeah, make a trade or stop wasting my time. Production complete. Network node. Population is getting better. So, laser squad. Yeah, let's get at least one to get the prototype done. Yeah, somebody beat us to the weather paradigm. That's okay. We can still build the Human Genome Project. Or we can focus on other things. Command Center. Switching production. Well, we have to switch production, no? Hold on. Did I misread that? I might have, actually. <laughs> Mine. Are we actually growing properly? Let's have a look. 24 turns, that's a bit slow. This one is stagnant. Which one is that? The one to the east, I think. Yeah, that's the one. It needs some farms on these tiles. I guess we'll work on that then. Okay, fine. It cannot build it. It was already completed. 
We need to switch to something else. Well, let's switch to Human Genome Project. Sounds good. A mine and a farm. Forest expands. Yeah, that's the nice thing about the forest. It can expand on its own. Alright, go get the farms. Thanks. And there's our first naval unit. We can explore a little bit. Let's see what we can find. We can grab the pods. Flat and moist. We will get a farm and another farm. What did we get? Oh, kelp forest. Okay. There are also some aliens over here. I think I'll just ignore them for now. Recreation commons. Labs bonus is fine. Production complete. And we got the first laser squad. Let's change. Command center. Unit max required ability. Alright, let's grab a sea colony pod. We can start one colony in the sea, why not? We got some aliens. Indigenous life forms. And the network node is done. How's the growth in here? Oh yeah, this one is stagnant. We need a few farms. Command center. Let's get rid of them. Oh, yep, they actually won there. Alright. Fair enough. Pod recovered. Got another pod. pod recovered. And another pod. 50 energy credits. Right, let's maybe attack this thing over here. We got a few units. Can we upgrade this guy? Let's see. I don't remember if we can actually upgrade units. I'll be honest. I assume you can. I just need to remember how. Or maybe you can't. Action. Yeah, I actually don't remember. <laughs> This Xenofungus is spreading. At least that's kind of how it looks like. Terrible. Might not be a bad idea to plant more forest. To prevent the spread. Okay, how's growth now? We might want to move this manually. 41 turns. That's still a little bit too slow. 21 turns. That's better. Okay, I don't think it will get much better until we get another tile with two food. But that works. Forest expands. Let's grab a forest here. Sounds good. And here, more forest. Oh, this isn't a new continent, that's literally the end of the map, right. The North Pole or whatever. More farms. What's the style? Rolling and rainy. Okay, farm. So what about this thing over here? That's a spore launcher. I assume we can get rid of it. I don't see why not. We only got one unit in this city, in this base. Should probably get more. Let's queue up a laser squad. Okay, that will do. We can also send one from Guildhouse. Destroyed. 
Oh no, now it's destroyed. All right. And we unlocked the particle impactor. Nice. That should be a nice upgrade. Yes, let's take a look. Impact squad. Impact rover, impact scheme ship. All right, what's next? Let's have a look. Aqua farm. Okay. If we want to settle a base in the sea, then unlocking an aqua farm sounds useful. Hold on, the sport launcher is still here. Perhaps a careful review of your options is in order. Not ready to attack. Fine, you can wait one turn. That's all we got in there. Improvement destroyed. Oh no, it's destroyed a farm. Yeah, that's not very good. To map the very stuff of life. To look into the genetic mirror and watch a million generations march past. That, friends, is both our curse and our proudest achievement. For it is in reaching to our beginnings that we begin to learn who we truly are. Academician Prokhor Zaharov, Address to the Faculty. So, we got the Human Genome Project. That's nice. Let's see what's next. How's the growth in here? Right, that's the base I was already looking at. 17 turns. We should get some stronger units. Let's grab an impact squad. Yep, sounds good. Production complete. Farm is fine. And attack. There, we got it. It won't destroy our farms anymore. Resupply pod, 100 energy, nice. For the next 20 years, we expect native life activity to increase dramatically. Okay, that sounds pretty bad. Sounds like we should get more impact squads. Let's maybe do that. Definitely a good idea. If there's going to be increased activity. Another resupply pod, good. Okay. The style is done. How's that sea colony pod? It's done. Nice. Let's switch to some units. How about impact squad? We need at least one impact squad in every colony, I guess. Now, where do we start this colony exactly? Somewhere close to actual resources, I guess. Nutrient bonus. Mineral bonus. Yeah, I'm thinking somewhere over here. Wouldn't it be terrible. This tile, for example. Okay, that sounds reasonable. Because this mineral isn't actually workable by what is this base called? Craftsman Keep. But this one will be workable by Guildhouse. So the idea is to start a colony here and get both the nutrient bonus and the minerals bonus. So grab a mine. Oh great, we spawned some units. How about we back up slightly? Yeah, they will attack us. Not surprising, I suppose. There's the command center. Impact squad. Right, how about we attack them? Do we even have enough units in here to attack? Should be fine. No, I don't want to defend, I want to attack. How about spanner works? No, that's not the one I was thinking about. Spanner works. This style. 
there's only one unit in here, apparently. Well, alright. It was enough, but that's just one unit killed. Let's move away from them, slightly. And we failed, damn it. That's slightly annoying. There's the laser squad to the rescue. Still going to start that colony. So, right here. Yep, sounds good. Sea work caverns. Good enough. And let's start from a garrison, shall we? Impact scheme ship. And then probably sea formers. Where are they? Right here. Insert. And then we'll see. Yeah, just finish the queue. Wait, what? Peacekeeper announced the seizure of Penzance. That's probably someone else's base. It's certainly not ours, I can tell you as much. I think we're safe for now. Looks like we're safe. Back into the base. Can we actually automate the formers? We can. I'm not sure just how smart they are going to be, but we can automate at least a few of them, I suppose. Maybe not every single one. But I'd like to see just how good the automation is going to be. Shall we upgrade all future laser squad production to impact squad? Yes, we should. Production all of it. Here's an impact squad. Let's see. Command center is fine. Automate this guy too. Anyway, I think I'm going to make a cut here and continue in the next episode. So thanks for watching, I hope you enjoyed it, and I'll see you next time. Bye bye.